Valentine's Day, sees the sales of flowers, predominantly roses, exceed 10 million in one day. It is estimated that over 1 million men and women spend in excess of $30 million on Valentine flowers. Men purchase the majority, however, it is becoming increasingly popular for women to buy and send flowers to men. Strong vibrant colors from exotics with sculptured sturdy shapes, with berries and foliage, as well as roses, are becoming ever more popular for women to purchase and send. The color of the roses scent also has hidden meanings, choose carefully to send the right message. Red roses are a sign of true love, moss rose means that you love someone from afar, purple roses represent everlasting love, beware sending yellow roses, as they give the message that you are jealous. While white roses say I love you not, roses are renowned for the sensuality of their silken petals, their fragrant titans falling in love. Scientific researchers have begun to discover that roses have specific chemicals which give us a happy feeling, and many aromatherapists use rose oil to reduce stress and tension. People do send flowers other than roses on Valentine's Day. There are a variety of spring flowers which also come in various shades of reds and pinks, if the traditional Valentine's colors are to be adhered to, however, it has recently become very trendy to send huge bouquets of spring flowers with a variety of vibrant colors or a bouquet of highly scented seasonal flowers including Narcissus, Lilac and Lily of the Valley. The exotic and rarely seen orchids, such as Oncidium with a mass of small butterfly-shaped flowers, or Pathia petalum, the slipper orchid, have become the most glamorous flowers for celebrities to be seen giving and receiving this season. Other exotics and tropical flowers, bird of paradise, with its unmistakable large blue, and orange flowers, or the tall, highly perfumed tuberose make a real statement of individualism and uniqueness, set as Valentine's flowers.